Om Shanti, welcome back. And today we are here with the 34th blessing, a beautiful blessing in which Baba tries to tell us that when I come down on earth, I give away all the secrets of my creation. I being the director, I know when the movie started on this earth, when the middle time came or the interval time came, when the part changed, when the villain entered or Ravan entered or the Satan entered. And now how will Satan be defeated? That means how will the Ravan Rajya go away? And how will the Ram Rajya or means the godly world or heaven will be established on this earth? Now imagine in this world drama, it's not just two hour movie, it's a long movie. And in this world drama, we get to know the secrets. So that means what is going to happen in the future. You already come to know. So when that happens, imagine your state of mind. You're peaceful, isn't it? It's like the teacher has released the whole paper to you before the test is going to come. You have all the answers with you. So once you have all the answers, you are somebody who's peaceful, who's relaxed. So Baba says in this blessing, may you be a detached observer. Now, when you know what's the paper, everybody else is in complete dismay. They are all panicking. Whereas you are a detached observer. You know, this was supposed to come. This is what Baba has told us. Like in this case, the coronavirus is supposed to come. A big disease is going to come, my children, in the future. Be ready for it. He had told us in Brahma Kumaris. So we are ready for all those things. We know what God has told us. How the world has become so tamopradhan or so degraded that the five elements are also very tired. So when God tells us everything what is going to happen in the future, imagine your state of mind. You are peaceful. So may you be a detached observer. And even while seeing a surprising scene, it was a surprise for all of us. It suddenly happened. Nobody was ready for it. So even while seeing a surprising scene, make a mountain into a mustard seed. Everybody is talking ill about it. Everybody is saying, oh, the whole world is going to come down. But when you have the answers, you make the mountain like a mustard seed. The whole situation becomes small in front of you. You don't panic. So let's go ahead in the details. Many new and surprising scenes will come in front of you. They have already come and many more are going to come. Be ready for that. What are those situations which are going to come? Come over to Brahma Kumaris, learn about the secrets of the future, learn about the whole world drama, learn about how to do meditation and much more in this. And Baba says, many new and surprising scenes will come in front of you while you are becoming complete. Complete means what? We are not going to get panicked like other people. Panic brings about frustration of fear. Now Baba says, he says that when you know the whole test paper, what's going to come in the future, you are ready. You don't have the fear. You are not surprised by the scenes which are coming in front of you. You are actually relaxed. You are constant in your mind. And so you start imbibing the qualities in you. So let's go ahead. Many new and surprising scenes will come in front of you while you are becoming complete. Complete means what? Complete with qualities. Now other people are frustrated, irritated, blaming. Whereas you are relaxed. You are fearless. You are having good wishes for others. You have got good thoughts for others. You are purifying your thoughts when other people are panicking. So those are the things which make you complete, Baba says. But let those scenes make you into a detached observer. You become a completely detached observer because you know what is the scene going to be in the future, what all test papers are going to come to you. So detached observer and not make you fluctuate in your mind. By seeing and deciding while seated on the seat of the stage of a detached observer. Now imagine you are detached completely. You are seated on your seat and you are relaxed, you are meditating. And while meditating, you are moving around, you are walking and you are meditating. You see a scene which has come in front of you, an accident. But you are relaxed. Other people are panicking. They are saying, oh my god, what happened? Some of them are not able to see the blood. They are falling off. Whereas you are relaxed because you have practiced so much. And you are able to take the right decisions at that time. So by seeing and deciding while seated on the seat of the stage of a detached observer. Imagine you are detached. You know the test paper. You know what's going to come in the future. So how are you when everybody else is panicking? You are relaxed. So you become a detached observer because you know the answers. You know how to face the situation. So here Baba says... 
you will enjoy yourself a lot because you are a detached observer there will then be no fear because baba has told us everything in brahma kumaris what's going to happen in the future he's even warned us about the different diseases which are going to come in the future how the war is going to take place how the world is going to become a place where everybody doesn't like each other in ghor kalyuga or extreme kalyuga so baba says there will then be no fear because you already know what is going to happen in the future the whole reel of the movie has been leaked to you the director has told you what's going to come in the play it will be as though you are once again seeing a scene you have seen many times before when you meditate you feel as if i have come across this you remember deja vu when you are in deja vu is when you are soul conscious when you are connected to your inner being when you stopped all your thoughts away that's when deja vu happens that's why it's so rare because people are not so soul conscious in this world only from time to time once in a year maybe or twice in a year somebody becomes soul conscious and they have a deja vu i've been here i've seen this person i feel i've come over here again why does that happen because you become soul conscious you become somebody who knows the future beforehand you can see through the past and the future and at that point of time the past and the future is there within you so you recognize that person you realize that situation you realize the place is nothing new for you you have no fear at that time that's when you are in deja vu or your six senses open so there will then be no fear it is it will be as though you are once again seeing a scene you have seen many times before such a soul baba says such a soul will be raz yukt raz means the secret yukt means complete they'll be full of all the secrets because god has revealed those secrets so it's nothing new for them they won't panic such a soul will be raz yukt and yog yukt means they'll be connected with god there is no panic earthquake is coming everybody else is panicking but you are a soul you are connected to god you are not panicking that's a test for a brahmin and make the atmosphere double light everybody is panicking whereas you are relaxed you are double light double light means i am a soul i am an connected to the supreme soul you are double light everybody is double heavy in the mind he will experience a paper that is like a mountain to be like a mustard seed imagine somebody who comes in your life makes a big problem very look very small how does that feel imagine you becoming that person who knows the complete secrets given by god is yog yukt is in meditation and you are able to help your family you are able to help your neighbors where everybody else is panicking but you are not panicking imagine that state of mind that's what we learn to become in brahma kumaris and we learn that meditation too so i welcome you and i request you to learn this meditation it's all given for free at brahma kumari center near your house itself so enjoy your day om shanti with this blessing